What is going on guys? Welcome back to another episode on the Chaos Craft server. In the last episode guys, we finished off the kitchen area over here and I asked you guys what you thought of my direction this season on Chaos Craft and we're going to go over all of them things today and I've got quite a few updates to tell you guys today. So stay tuned. It's quite some important news about Chaos Craft SMP server. But guys, as you can see in this area over here, I have put some rugs down. I've put some rugs in the living room area, in the dining room area and in the kitchen area and that is because i don't know if you guys can notice there is no torches anywhere we have done the lighting there's pretty much this glowstone underneath all this rug underneath this rug over here and it's doing enough to light up the house this area over here was a little bit tricky because i didn't want this snow to melt so i had to like place it in like like far, far away from the snow like one here one here not get too close to this snow area and i could do it around the back here as well and i also had to put some lighting in the corner up there do you remember in season two when i did that lighting trick with carpet and and some string and i did that up there you can only see the string when you get close to it so it's kind of cool because when you're like from here you can't even see the string so it's really cool way to light up your house but today guys we're going to be working on this side of the house this is going to be like a toilet area some shelves this is going to be the shower some sink areas over here and this is going to be a walk-in closet i think because i don't really know what else to put there but as we're doing that guys we are going to talk about the updates which i've got to um update you guys about <laughs> that's what updates are for right so guys um for the updates first thing was um in the last episode i asked you guys what do you think of the direction that i'm taking chaos craft this season and the response was overwhelmingly positive overwhelmingly why does that out for <laughs> the response was overwhelmingly positive and you guys are really enjoying the building aspect of this season and all that kind of cool stuff that we are doing and that's amazing for me to do a video that you guys enjoy it cannot get any better than that really so um but i did hear a few of you a few of you want me to mix it up sometimes you don't want me you love the building but you want me to mix it up sometimes so i will do that guys is um because i said i'm going to do a lot of building and stuff this season oh why did i do that i want to make a flower pot um, because I said I'm going to do a lot of building and stuff this season, that doesn't mean I'm not going to do any collabs or anything like that. Collabs are still going to be a part of the server. Like we're still going to go and like kill the Ender Dragon together. We're still going to do all them cool things. So you will get some collabs coming up here and there on the Chaos Craft server. It's just that when I'm not doing collabs i want to focus on my building side of things to keep things nice and entertaining so that is that i just wanted to reassure people that collabs are still going to be there we're still going to do things like i think i think tomorrow or this next episode we have an abba caving episode planned so look forward to that so we're so we're still going to have collabs and stuff um but yeah we're going to focus on the building and have collabs that is the plan for this season so yeah guys let's move on to the update so there has been a few things that have changed on chaos craft in the last couple of weeks and i need to keep you guys updated with what is going on so guys firstly the new update on the server is that sadly ye old mama has decided to leave the chaos craft server i don't know if she's going to do a video about it soon she might do she might do a tweet or something like that letting her fans know uh why she decided to leave the server but to keep things short and sweet to tell you guys i don't think she'll mind me telling because it's not it's not a bad reason it's totally understandable but yo mama has decided to take her channel in a completely different direction and she is no longer doing any minecraft videos on her channel anymore so no minecraft means no chaos craft so she decided you know what it's probably for best that i leave the server because i don't want to record any more minecraft videos so the old mama decided she's going to leave the server because she's completely changing up her channel and doing what do, taking it in a different direction which is completely understandable guys you guys know my standpoint on people who want to take their channels in different directions it is their channel they can do whatever they want if if tomorrow i want to stop minecraft videos videos and i want to start being a gta channel then no one can stop me can they that is what i want to do and every other youtuber on the chaos craft i just put a, a toilet paper head on my head every other youtuber on the chaos craft server can do the same as if they want to change up their channel they can do whatever they want so i wish you old mama all the best and good luck uh, for changing it up on her channel i wish i hope it all goes well but yep yeah, yo mama is no longer going to be uploading minecraft videos which means she is no longer going to be uploading any chaos craft videos as well so that is the first update that i wanted to tell you guys 
But guys, on a lighter note, uh, the second update which I want to tell you guys is that we have a new member on the server. Now, I know a lot of you guys might be thinking, you know, you're getting excited thinking, whoa, who's the new member? I really want to know. I want to go subscribe to him. But guys, you have to wait for this one because it's slightly different to what you're used to when it comes to new members. So recently, I got a message from somebody called Piccolis. You guys must remember who Piccolis was. He has been on the server two times before. He was on the server in season two twice. He came and came left, came back, left and came back. So he's on the server twice. And um, he is on the server again now for season three. Now let me explain to you what is going on with this one because some of you might be a bit confused. So Piccolis no longer does YouTube. He has not, he doesn't have a YouTube channel anymore. He he deleted his channel. He doesn't have any videos. He no longer uploads videos, but he still plays Minecraft. So one day I was on on Skype and Piccolis messaged me because so it's, some of you might not realize this, guys. I'm still friends with a lot of Chaos Craft members. Like I deactivate. I talk to him pretty much every, nearly every day, probably every couple of days. I talk to I deactivate. Um, Piccolis. I always used to talk to him whenever he was free. I still talk to a lot of Chaos Craft members. Chaos dude. I talk to him every now and again as well. So I'm still friends with a lot of Chaos Craft members. That's when I say to you guys like, there's no hard feelings when people leave the server. It, it's a hundred percent true. There never is any hard feelings when people leave the server. Um, but yeah, Piccolis messaged me on Skype one day and he was like, Hey Biggs, what what's going on? I said, Hey, hey man, nothing much, and we're just chatting like we normally do every now and again. And he said to me, like, he really misses playing Minecraft playing on a server and he's looking for an SMP. He didn't ask me to join Chaoscraft at this point, he just said he was looking for an SMP. And I said, Oh, that's cool, man. I hope you find one. And then that was that was the end of the conversation. So then a couple days later, he messaged me again and he said he couldn't really find an SMP and he has a very strange question to ask me. And I said, OK, man, what, what, what's the question? He said to me, I really want to plan an SMP and I can't really find one with a good community and I really get along with you guys. And, and that was true. Piccolis got along very well with every single member on the server. Like he was good friends with Conman, good friends with Fancy, with me and Zai. He got, he got along with everybody. And he said to me, is it possible that I could be on Chaos Craft um, for season three, but not record and upload videos. So as you guys know, we are a YouTuber server. That is one of the requirements to be on be, to be on Chaos Craft is that you have to be a YouTuber and you have to upload videos and be an active member on the server. That is one of the requirements that we have for the server. So Piccolis not being a YouTuber kind of meant that we was running into a few little problems. Like he he's not a YouTuber. So I spoke to him about it and i brought it to all the other members on the chaos craft server and i said to them like what do you guys think about this and stuff like that and because we all got along with piccolis so well we decided that we're going to give piccolis a chance we know that he's not uploading videos and we know that it, um, he's not a YouTuber at the moment, but we're going to give him the benefit of the doubt purely because he is our friend. He is our friend and we're letting and we're letting him back on the server for this season. But there was some requirements that we made clear to Piccolis. We said to him, OK, Piccolis, so if you are not going to upload and you're not a YouTuber, we it, one of the requirements and this wasn't from me. This is from everybody. Everybody came into agreement for this. One of the requirements is that you are as active on the server as possible and you join in with as many group activities as possible and he said of course that's all I wanted to do I just wanted to play Minecraft with my friends so we kind of made a special exemption for Piccolis we allowed him to join season three because he is our friend that is pretty much the reason so I know some of you may be thinking oh does this mean I can join because I'm not a youtuber sadly guys it doesn't just because we, we seriously just made an exemption for Piccolis because we we know him and um, he is our friend and we know that he's going to be an active member and stuff like that. So sadly, th it doesn't mean that you guys can join the server if you're not a YouTuber. If you are a YouTuber, feel free to apply and the application is in the description if you want to apply for the server. But uh, we made a special kind of exemption for Piccolis because everybody on the server really got along well with Piccolis and he was our friend. So when a friend wants to like play a game with you, you can't really say no, can you? He's, he's our friend. We just helped him out. Um, he wanted to come and play um, Minecraft with us and that's what we let him do. Um, but yeah, guys, it, it, we'll probably do the same for any other past Chaos Craft members as well. It's not like... 
It's not like if you leave Chaoscraft, that's it. You can never ever come back. No, we're we're not that kind of community, guys. We 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 we're always open to old members. Like I said, I all I'm still I still talk to I deactivate all the time. I still talk to Picklers. I still talk to Chaos Dude whenever I get a chance. You know, we're all still friends when people leave the server. So it's um it was nice to hear from Picklers and it's nice to see him back on the server. So expect to see some some video from videos not videos so expect to see pickles around on the server joining in with some videos like some um some collabs when we go kill the ender dragon and stuff like that expect to see pickles around i think that will be really fun if you guys enjoyed pickles you're still going to get your dose of pickles but he's going to be in other people's videos rather than his own videos so yeah guys there we go so we've got a shower now i'm not sure i like this floor here but um we have a shower this is going to be our shower for our thing and over here we are going to do uh, a little sink area i think the house is coming together really nice i want to put some more detail around this area though guys i think it will look a lot better let me put like a towel next to here yeah that looks good it looks like a little towel next to the shower so we've got a little shower there i might do the redstone and stuff on it i'm not 100 percent sure just yet i'll probably do that in a live stream or something but um it's looking good i do like this um should i put glowstone up there hmm let's see how far up we can go can we go up there? Is that going to be outside? No, it's not. Cool. So I can put some glowstone. But yeah, guys, that is pretty much all the updates that we had for Chaos Craft today. Um, tons of, well, quite big updates. We haven't had any updates like that in a long time. So yeah, yo mama leaving the server and Pickles is a brand new member. But guys, it, uh, while we're on the, uh, the subject of new members, we do want to add new members to the server guys. So if you are a YouTuber and you do YouTube videos and you've been doing YouTube for quite a while, make sure you apply for the server if you want to be on an smp there is no subscriber requirement or anything like that so don't think that you have to have like a hundred thousand subs or anything like that because look at like jamesy jamesy's got five thousand subscribers and he's a brilliant member on the server like i never regret adding jamesy to the server he's such a good member to have on the server so don't think it's based on um on subscribers it's mainly based if you ever if you guys ever wondered what it's based on like n adding new members to the server we mainly base it on the channel like we look at their channel and we just think do we like this channel and like everybody on the server do we like this channel and people either say yes or people either say no we don't think they're really a good fit for chaos craft and that's it that is it guys so if any of you ever thought like oh i don't have enough subscribers to join chaos craft you you might be wrong guys because if we like your channel then you might have a chance to join the server so there is an application form in the description if you do want to join the just the application form does ask for subscribers amount and how many views you get and stuff like that but that's just a formality because um what it what, what that does that separates people who are youtubers and people who are not youtubers you know because if you're not a youtuber then you don't have like a channel so um they can't fill that section in that's why we have that section um and and the reason we have that section is because a lot of people like to lie i've got applications apparently on the application form from pewdiepie and then they say that pewdiepie gets like 10 views a month which is not true <laughs> so we know that none's not a real a, a real application so um yeah um but there we go guys that is mainly all the updates so what we're going to do now we're going to work on i'm going to work on a little closet area here there was something that i wanted to do i want to do a sink thing probably going to do a similar sink to what i did in there over here oh no put that down there but i wanted to do like a little closet let me see if i could do this let's put one there one there and one there and one there like that and then i've never really done this before can i do this aha look at that so that looks like kind of like a clothes hanger right where you'd hang up your clothes i think that looks really really cool so what i want to do here as well is do a little shelving unit which i think will look really good let's um put that down yeah there's a nice part uh, you know what guys it does anyone else feel like dual wielding in minecraft the new feature of dual wielding is just a bit weird like I, it, I just don't like it I do it to save inventory space but whenever I like try and build up like this it's so weird because you always place a torch down and I don't like that I don't know I don't know if I like dual wielding that much it's a little bit it's a little bit funny it's good to save inventory space but I, other than that I'm not sure I'm a big fan on it to be honest I'm really not sure I need some rugs and stuff here I need some stuff around here as well let's let's try something here let's put like a oh let's, let's box let's say hate to box Hey box 
Um, let's try something here, see if we got anything. We need some half slabs. Do we have, uh, can we make some? Yeah, there we go. Let's make some half slabs right there. Probably going to need a bit more than that. Um, let's do that. I want I want to put something there because I think that looks a bit bland. We're going to need like little things around the house now like this to just kind of fill it up because these spaces are kind of bland. We've got all the kind of features in the house that we want. We're going to do the bedroom and stuff a little bit later on, but we've got all the features that we want in the house. We just need to add some little details, stuff like this. This is just going to be like a... Um, it's like a little kind of table, you know, table with some detail. I want to get some some custom heads, just some like random ones, maybe like a creeper head and stuff like that. And then we can add stuff like that around that. See, that looks nice to me. Wait, wait, let's, um, what does it look like if I put like, I don't know, like that there. Yeah, I like that. That looks good. And I might put a picture up there like a, oh, can you get, can you get a three by two picture? I'm not sure. But yeah, we need a load of these things around the house and fill up these places with some rugs so I can put some lighting in here. And uh, let me just jump back up here because I wanted to put the slabs on top of here. Can I do it by jumping? Oh, I might be able to. Let's see if we can do this. There we go. There we go. Nice. So we've got a little shelving unit there. And what I want to do next to that is I just want to add some double chests just to add some more storage up here, which I think would be really cool. But... As usual, I think I'm prepared, but I never am prepared. I never am. So guys, there was another topic that I wanted to talk about in today's video, which I forgot to actually talk about in last week's, no, last episode. I forgot to talk about it in last episode. But what I wanted to talk to you guys about was the possibility of me introducing different games to the channel once a week. Now, I know I've spoken about this before to like old subscribers. So if you're an old subscriber, you've probably heard me mention this quite a few times. But I'm talking to like the new subscribers and the old subscribers here. Now, as you guys may realize that my schedule on my channel has kind of changed recently. I don't have that much series as I used to. Like before, I used to have like factions. I used to have sims. I used to have a lot of series on the channel. But now I don't really have as much as I used to have and um, that, that's fine with me as long as you guys enjoy my content I'm absolutely happy with that but there's something I noticed recently is that I play a lot of games like I play Overwatch I play GTA I record GTA once a week with Vadact and being on the board well I don't record it I'm in the recording with them so what I'm wondering guys would you guys like me to record stuff like that when I'm playing with like Vadact when I'm playing with Command, playing Overwatch and stuff like that would you like to see that stuff and would you like me to upload it to the channel once a week? Now, this is not going to be something that's going to be like flooded on my channel. We're not going to start being a random games channel and you're going to see a load of random games. No, that's not that's not going to happen. What, uh, what I might do is dedicate one day a week. I think it might be a Tuesday. I'm not quite sure yet where I'm going to upload. Well, I'm, not gonna, I'm saying going to. I'm just going to see how I'm going to see what the response is to this video first. Um, where I might upload every Tuesday just a random game like I don't know next Tuesday might be like a GTA video and then the following Tuesday after that might be like I don't know a gang beast video or something like that you know just just like so, so some random games uh, what do you guys think of that is that something that you like is that an idea that you like because I know a lot of you are subscribed to my channel for my Minecraft, for my Let's Builds and my How To Tutorials and stuff like that. That's never going to go away, guys. That's always going to be on my channel. But Tuesday at the moment, I all I do is live stream. And I was, talk, and I was thinking, you know what? I could fit another episode in or maybe on a Monday because I don't have anything uploaded on a Monday at the moment. So what I could do on a Monday is just upload like a random funny game. Like I could play like Happy Wheels or something like that. Would you guys like to see that? Uh, that's just something I really wanted to ask you guys. Now, I am completely completely out of quartz which is a little bit disappointing because I thought I might have enough to finish off that area over there but it doesn't look like I do so other than that little sink area there guys we we got the little bathroom finished we got I bought these custom heads at spawn at spawn at spawn can't so every episode I feel like I mess up my words I don't know what it is I see the toilet head and it's kind of like this is meant to be where you like keep the toilet brush but it's actually a cup but I put it there just for like the toilet brush which I think looks really cool you know what we should do here actually so we don't have to have the torches in here 
we can put some glowstone down and this could be a little rug so this is what i'm going to do guys now to light up the house i was thinking about putting stuff in the ceiling but i think i'm just going to put glowstone in the floor because i think it lights it up really nicely we're going to have a long rug going th through here probably a four wide rug so let me mark out the corners and i will put glowstone there so probably like this Yes, it's going to be like a four wide rug here and then where's the middle? So we've got one, two, three and then knock, knock out one there, one, two, three and then knock out one there like that. So this is going to be like the lighting. I'm going to do a nice little rug design there and this is going to light up this area. It's nice to have lighting in the floor under carpet because then you can just get rid of all the torches. Look at that. No, this area is a bit dark there. I don't think any would think will spawn there. So we're going to have a, rug, a little rug there. We're probably going to have a rug in this room as well. Let's mark this out too we're probably gonna have like a rug there 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 and oh underneath there where the snowman is let's put let's put the glowstone down so this is me right now guys just marking out the rugs <laughs> in the room so um i don't have to have torches down everywhere i don't know what it is guys i was speaking to this about Z the other day and i feel like lighting in minecraft is such a weird thing like torches are so ugly i don't like torches i really really don't like torches in minecraft i think they're ugly i think like when you use them for your houses they don't look nice and stuff like that and jay -Z agreed with me today and um using glowstone and stuff i don't think that looks really nice especially if you don't have a texture pack like glowstone looks ugly so it's best to kind of hide lighting the only way to light up places now in minecraft is to hide it like put it behind glass or put it behind rugs and stuff like that i personally think there should be a block in minecraft called a light block that you kind of like craft out of glowstone and redstone and then you can put it on ceilings like this you know like with a button i can put that on the ceiling could you imagine if that was a light block and then it shined out light and then you could have like lights on the on the ceiling like that how cool would that look like a little spotlight I think that should be in Minecraft and it should just be called a light and you craft it with redstone and glowstone or glowstone and quartz or something like that and then you've got a little block that's a light block and you can just put it on the ceiling like that. I think that would be a really cool uh, thing to have but all we've got in Minecraft at the moment is glowstone, sea lanterns and jack-o'-lanterns which are really big blocks and you have to hide them when you want to use them. Um, oh wait that's not in the center is it? Let's put another one there actually let's let's save on our glowstone and put one diagonal from it right there like that so do we have a spruce yes we do but guys i think i have done all i can do for today's episode don't think there's any more like flower pots i can put around let's maybe put one there can, can we actually put a flower in that whilst it's underneath that will it let us oh yeah it does so we can just add some more decoration around put a flower pot there we'll probably add some more there when i get some quartz like we've got a little sink going on we're gonna add a unit up there as well uh might add a mirror or something i'm not quite sure and we've got a little closet which i'm gonna add a rug and i'm just gonna add a big picture on the wall there for our little closet as well the house is really coming along i might change this wall here to orange oh no we've got that wall orange over there so we've got the orange in the house yeah it's really coming along nicely so next we're gonna work on this area this is gonna be the bedroom and this which i haven't decided on yet whether it's going to be office and shout out room and then we're going to work on all the necessities that we need like our storage room enchantment room it's all going to be down here so we've got tons to do in the house and don't forget guys whilst we're doing all that there will be the odd episode here and there where we're going to be doing collabs uh killing the ender dragon with other youtubers on the server so if you're enjoying season three so far guys trust me you're going to be enjoying it a lot more because there is a lot more to come but guys thank you so much for watching really hope you enjoyed it and i'll see you again in another episode on the chaos craft server we're going to get our redstone block power the piston so it pushes it down we're going to destroy the redstone block place any block in the gap right there power it one more time and then we can see that the glass gets pushed down perfectly on top of the armor stand so it